All right, it's DJ Gatsby of the talk show with DJ Gatsby. We're here at the uh, Nyack Center with Rockland County Legislator Tony Earl. Good afternoon, sir. How are you doing today? Good, Jeff. How are you? Uh, I'm here, uh, a past recipient of, of this event uh, at Nyack Center. Uh, my wife and I were honored. We're here last year. It's a very uh, good and proud and established uh, uh, community service uh, center here, and they do great things. Uh, I'm glad to, to see all the uh, recipients here uh, from the Martin Luther King debated speeches and so forth, the plays, the dances. Uh, it's just a really great night for all of us, and uh, we're very proud of all the good work that the Nyack Center does, and I think this is uh, their fourth year with this and uh, I'm very proud of them as a county legislator. Thank you. All right, DJ Gaston, we're here at the Nyack Center with Victor. Congratulations on winning the award, Victor. Can you tell us a little bit how you feel and how important winning this award or being honored here today means to you? Feel on a more of a spiritual level to accept something like this at this time of my life. Very honored. Very honored. All right. Once again, congratulations. You're doing a wonderful job. We appreciate your service. Have a great day and thank you. Thank you, sir. We're here at the Nyack Center with uh, honoree. Uh, Reverend Mac Williams, uh, Reverend Williams, tell us uh, how important this award is to you and what it means to you. Well, this uh, award is very important. What it says to me is that the work that I have been a part of in the community uh, is respected and, and there are people who are thankful for it, but it also lets me know that there's more work to do, more work to be done, and I'm, I'm looking forward to continuing that work. Thank you for your time and congratulations again. Thank you. Uh, we're here at Nike at the Nike Center. We're talking to uh, honoree Vanessa Green. Vanessa, congratulations on being honored here today. Tell us a little bit about this uh, award and what it means to you. It means a lot to me. I know whose shoulders I stand on. I'm privileged and humbled to receive this award because the work I do, um, I don't really think I should be receiving awards, but I will um, accept this on behalf of those who have been murdered. Um, by state sanction, so um, I'm privileged and honored, and um, I'm glad that I did receive it. And <laughs> really, you did great. <laughs> oh, <edit. laughs> you said it would be that long, so I'm like, oh, I know. Yeah. Hi, DJ Gasset. We're here uh, at the Nyack Center with uh, Arlene from Naomi's. Um, what is that? Program of Excellence. Naomi's Program of Excellence. Uh, tell us a little bit about your group and also about the performance that the kids put on here today. My name is Arlene Fabio. I'm the president of Naomi's Program of Excellence. We're a nonprofit organization. We've been in existence here in Rockland County since 2002. And our mission is to enhance and enrich the cultural, academic, and social opportunities for our children, our community children, here in Rockland County. And um, we partner with organizations like the Nyack Center. We participated in their uh, African American uh, cultural uh, celebration for Black History Month. And we put on, put on an original skit tonight in celebration of some of the major themes throughout the civil rights movement that have been carried through to today. And today's piece was entitled, In the News, Still Chasing the Dream. It was an excellent representation of the civil rights movement and some of the impact that uh, young people have had in the organization and in the movement. So. All right. Well, can you tell us a little bit about how people can um, participate or become a part of uh, what you're doing? Well, Naomi's Program of Excellence is a community-based organization. We're a grassroots group. Um, we're 15 families here in Rockland County. And um, we do open up our, our membership uh, periodically to accept new families into the organization. And um, we look to partner with families who have a similar mission for their children. 
as we do, and it's all about enrichment, cultural advancement, educational opportunities, expanding the reach for the children so that they can better their opportunities for college and beyond. So any family that really has a similar mission um, as, as what we are sponsoring, that we are certainly, we're open to, uh, to cultivating them within the organization. Okay, well, you guys did a wonderful job here today. Um, what can the community look forward to in the future uh, or any upcoming events that you guys have? Well, our upcoming events are many and varied. We have a wonderful health and wellness uh, committee that works with uh, the community. We just recently had a wonderful grooming uh, session for our young males in Rockland County. And it was all about helping them to improve and be aware of their appearance and their presence as they move forward to um, you know, go for job interviews, apply to colleges, and really represent themselves as professional young men stepping out into the world. We do quite a bit of that. We partner with other organizations here in Rockland.